Now, Singapore's seafood production sector, it's getting a boost with a new innovation center that's going to focus on R&D and training. This will augment Singapore's ambition of increasing its local food production to 30% of consumption by 2030. Cheryl Lin with more. Singapore is scaling up its seafood production industry. The new Aquaculture Innovation Centre at Tomasic Polytechnic aims to attract and train Singapore's next generation of experts. Its R&D will also look to improve production processes. In these tanks are fish of different species but also different growth stages. What they're for is to find out how exactly to better optimize the nutrition of fish feed. That's the main focus of the centre because fish feed constitutes a large majority of all production costs. Studies at the lab will also focus on marine life disease management and breeding. And these efforts are critical as food supply resiliency and sustainability have become pressing issues worldwide. And Singapore's focus on aquaculture is not just timely but also a strategic move. It may be well placed to capitalize on the food sector's potential. Our strong innovation ecosystem, our robust intellectual property protection and our standards framework as well as our very pro-business environment put Singapore in an excellent position to become a leading player in the urban agriculture and aquaculture industry. The centre is pooling knowledge and resources by bringing together government agencies, universities and polytechnics. To train this very unique kind of uh, industry, deep skill we are talking about, okay, so require a lot of experts. So if we don't pull all the talent from different IHR coming together, everybody will do some form of education, yes, but they are compromising the quality. Because no matter what, we cannot have a complete competency in all areas. So it's good that we have a, a, a focal point. The centre is backed by Enterprise Singapore and the agency believes Singapore's fish industry can cast its net further into global markets. Ultimately, we want to drive internationalisation, which is our farms here will not just produce for domestic consumption, but we have enough uh, volume to actually also export and also bring our technology overseas. For example, we are working very close with Brunei, uh, Oman and so on, so for potential collaboration. The centre will also help small and medium enterprises level up through workshops and conferences.